acting crazy. Oh. <laughs> yeah. There is something very, very powerful about unlocking all the trapped emotions in your face when you get all crazy like that. Oh, I don't know what's going on there. Hey. <laughs> yeah, there's something truly crazy about it. Can't you tell? <laughs> <laughs> you guys, nope, you guys nope. ever do this? You just get a lot of reps. Fucking Gene Simmons over here. It feels crazy. <laughs> I got a scared. big tongue. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what the f are we doing? You actually, I think you not I think you hold the record for living and traveling with us the most of any immersion oh, who's ever. He happened. takes the record by like weeks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we do these immersion programs where it's one person they come and stay with us for usually three to four days and we just dive deep into bioenergetics emotion your purpose all kinds of powerful things this time we decided to do a hybrid yep. you have been with us now two weeks yep. and two separate retreats yep. two weeks and two retreats it was like two months yeah lifetime mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. so, yeah i was lucky enough to go on the bungee jump retreat with them for two days um and we just finished multiversity on an incredible campus yesterday. Yeah. Work. Where he gave an impromptu freestyle clinic in the middle of the circle. Oh, that was dope. Yeah, dude. that was cool. That was actually the moment where I was like, damn, dude, this dude is tapping fully into like your your leadership role. Mm -hmm. And that's that was I mean, not the first time, but that was one of the most strongest examples where I was like, damn, Ben is literally like a leader in this clique right now. Yeah. And what would you say has been like the biggest transition you felt internally after these past two weeks? Yeah, I had something. I have a little tidbit about each one of these guys, um, and that's what's coming through me right now. Yep. So I have healthy habits with Ryan and ways to get into your body. Um, he showed me how to get my day together in a way that makes sense, that I don't lose track of uh, reactivity and really staying on purpose. Um, with Jordan, I kind of understood that if I continue to live a general life, I'm going to get general results, mm. how to ask everything specifically, um, and get incredibly clear on that. And also, I think I upped my average like scorecard uh -huh. on the ball ball court from uh -huh. like averaging maybe 1.5 points <laughs> a game to I think I just got like 20. Triple double. Triple double. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let go of past trauma with Kevsky. Mm. Um, how to articulate the world around me in a way that's effective endless bar sessions <laughs> um, and by bar sessions it means freestyle bars, freestyle bars. <laughs> uh -huh. we might have gone to a few bars too <laughs> <laughs> I'll never tell. and just how I want to show up as a man um, and then as a 24 year old and what that means to me um, and yeah, learn from a master in my, my opinion so. uh, thank you brother yeah, yeah. what do you got for him j -Mo? yeah to your point on the ball court, the old basketball ball in front. Um, one of the, like on the, maybe the third day you were here, we went to play basketball. We've now played like four times, I think, since you've been here. And we were just playing one-on-one, -on -one, kind of casual. And after the first game, I noticed that I felt like he was better than he was playing. I could tell he knew how to dribble and he could shoot, but he was very, playing very passively, both on defense and he would just like take the easy shots instead of like getting into my body a little bit and like finishing strong. And so I called him on that. I was like, you know what, man? I like radical honesty right now. I feel like you're pulling punches and I feel like there's a correlation in the way you show up in life uh, as a divine masculine or lack thereof and how you're showing up on the basketball court. And as soon as I called awareness to that, you started being much more bold in playing in that particular session. And then every session since, you've gotten more and more like of a baller, bro. Where you're just like driving hard, getting into the body. And this last time, last couple times, really, I'm like, damn, Ben is a good basketball yeah. player. And mm -hmm. I know from my life, how I show up for one thing is how I show up for everything. And there's such a like crossover and permeation of sorts with yeah every aspect of my life and so that's like watching that very like tangible thing as a result of all these other things happening over the past couple weeks has been like in insanely inspiring yeah, yeah. No, I feel that it, what came up for me was the moment I got off the plane to see these guys how tight how the layers that needed to be shed and how aware I was of, of what those were and the, these guys just pulled it out of me constantly and held me to the standard that one I know that I have just need that reflected back on me but it's been incredible like, I honestly do not even feel like the same person so if anybody is out there that would like to experience that um, it's a massive shift yeah. internally externally 
the way I'm even communicating to you right now would have, you know, I would have had to probably clean my pants out a couple times. <laughs> Getting the old Dude. pants out. Yeah. And, and the, other <laughs> thing, times. the other thing that's crazy is that, like, in your actual life, you are no slouch, dude. You are a freaking badass registered nurse. Traveling nurse. Traveling yeah. nurse that is. They don't just take anybody to do that shit. So, you have, on the one hand, you have this very successful career. And then, yet, on the other hand, there's parts where you're like, I want to show up even stronger, man. Yep. And so, diving into the areas that maybe aren't traditional, not necessarily on your career, yep. on the other things that actually contribute to a. a kind of better overall life man yeah facing fear every day with these guys um, has been probably one of the most things I'm grateful for the most um, because it, it's permeates every aspect of your life fear shows up in so many different ways yep. and these guys will pull it out of you so. damn straight and I'm curious Ben like if this if this experience has been a hero's journey which I believe it has highly biased because I created it <laughs> I created it but I want to I know two things Two tings? Two tings. <laughs> what did you come to get? What were you seeking? And now what are you going to do as you get on the plane in about you know, an hour and a half? What yeah. are you going to do when you get home to bring home the elixir? Mm -hmm. The return. Yeah, yeah. I was seeking uh, clarity on, on passion and purpose with, uh, I think, the new generation of men that are coming up with me. And I wanted to find my people. I think you said that find, after a retreat you went on, find my people that are going to create this vision with me um, and get out of my comfort zone. I've done everything right up until this point, so I was seeking how can I get out of the matrix, whatever label you want to put on it. How can I find my place in this new world that I know is coming and that I'm excited to bring my best version to? Mm. When I get off the plane, yeah. uh, man, I'm going to speak some truth to my family. Uh-oh. Mm. He won't do it because he's going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> and... Yeah, really go to Europe. I'm going to Europe, going on another vacation and becoming even more clear on starting some men's retreats, um, starting up my own thing to coach guys on the initiation process that's effective and to bring in this new masculinity that I think is real important. And mm -hmm. along with these guys as well. Yeah. yeah. Many collaborations gonna be yeah. going down, brother. Yeah, Come many on, ancient wow. civilizations we will we will hack and find. Yeah. <gasps> Heard it here. To, so. <laughs> Sacred Sites Tour coming 2019. Yeah, well, yeah. Well, that was a sneak peek of what's going to happen, folks, but we'll, we'll get folks. <laughs> For all the folk people out there. How many times can you say folks? <laughs> all right. Oh. Oh wow, there's just like some interesting. Yeah, this, Facebook's some, doing some weird something, thing. Uh, Facebook Live is Facebook. compromised, but <laughs> anyway, signing off from Santa Cruz, California, sending off this young hero back into the, his ordinary world, yeah. which will be no longer. Ordinary. Extraordinary. Yeah. Let's go ahead and end it man, let's end it with one group on man. Yeah, I mean, hey, obviously. Hey, hey, man. So, yeah. Come yeah. on. So we're gonna bring we're gonna bring you in on this. Let's bring him in the middle. Yeah, you guys can feel what I'm like. on the ground. Uh, okay. Uh, right, yeah. Okay. All right. That's All right. Fun. Exhale All right. out. y'all. Peace.